Hey, I'm Christine. I'm Tyler. And I'm Pam. And we're carried away. I know, I know that you are near. I'll cry to you so I may be right where you Well, Carried Away started in the year 2000, and it started when Christine was hanging out with Colleen and I a lot, and she came over to our house one day, and she said that she was entering this music competition as a solo artist, and we started singing this Point of Great song together, Keep the Candle Burning, and we were like, whoa, guys, this is so cool. We should enter together. So we were entering a competition, and we won first place. Um, after that, just different churches started calling us and asking us to lead worship on Sunday. And in the beginning, we just did it because, you know, we thought it was really cool and fun. And then um, about a couple years after that, we decided to head down to Nashville. We went down to Nashville just to see our, the different options that um, were available. And we weren't really planning on making a record or anything like that. And so we got there and we met with a few people, a few producers, just to see what it was all about, the whole music industry. And uh, we ended up meeting our first producer down there, um, Otto Price. We just really clicked with him and he really caught the vision of Carried Away and what we wanted to do. And so we ended up recording our first album called Closer to You. And we began touring with different artists like Casting Crowns and Avalon. Since Carried Away's started, we have won a few Covenant Awards, such as um, Pop Contemporary Song of the Year for I Know and also Pop Contemporary Album of the Year for Closer to You and also we have won Pop Contemporary Song of the Year for I Want You and we've been nominated for Seasonal Song of the Year and also Pop Contemporary Album of the Year. So uh, Colleen actually moved on to other things and she's uh, yeah doing her own thing right now and uh, we got a brand new member which is really exciting you know what I thought it was gonna be really hard with a, a guy in the group kinda like vocally or or whatever I, I didn't know what to expect but he has been such a breath of fresh air and he's just like fitting in like like a glove <laughs> uh, my first job I think I was 12 years old and I actually played piano for a ballet school so working with a bunch of girls around, started at a young age, and uh, now, 21, I'm touring with what used to be an all-girl group, so it's kind of cool how that worked out. Well, Carried Away is definitely a business, but we have made it a priority that it is a ministry, first and foremost. We do this because we feel that God has called us to this ministry and to, has called us to go out across um, the world, if He so wishes. Um, to minister to people and to tell them that, that God loves them and that He has a plan for their lives. You know, something that I talk about is how it doesn't matter um, your past, it doesn't matter all the, the things that have happened or the mistakes you've made or, or anything like that. Like God is more powerful than that, God is bigger than that, He's bigger than any situation, any mistake, anything like that. And the beautiful thing is that God just picks us up out of that and he says you are my child you are mine and you are clean and you you know you are you and he says to me you are Christine you are mine and so just looking back and seeing what you know I've been through I just want to sh just share with other people you Our mission for Carried Away is to go out and to um, just encourage people to come to that decision in their, in their lives, to want more out of this life, to want more than just the, the mundane life, but to, 
to want God and to realize that there's nothing else in this world more important than that relationship with Jesus. That is um, the foundation that our lives should be built around. But also more than that, to once you have come to that conclusion or that decision, um, to strive for holiness. You know, it's not not seeing how close you can get to that that line, but seeing how close you can get to God and going deeper with Him and seeking after Him. And that's basically what our mission is just as Christians, you know? And, and so we do that through song and we do that through just speaking at our concerts, different stuff like that. And in, in our everyday lives, we should be examples of that, of Christ. I think carried away could go really far. If God wants it to, I think carried away could just take off because the heart is there. They're, they're great singers, they're great songwriters, and you know, and we're great friends, and I just think it has a lot of potential, but ultimately it's what God wants. Love.